Hey guys, welcome back. So today's video is going to be uh, this right here, a bloody scrape knuckle look. And I have it covered with a band-aid here. I'm just going to uncover that and you'll see the full four scrape knuckles after a horrible fight or some sort of altercation. So hope you enjoy. If you want to see how it's done, go ahead and keep on watching. And here's a close-up on those knuckles. Ouch, that looks like it would hurt. And this is my FX Skin Illustrator palette. I'm just going to uh, put in a little bit of 99% alcohol in that color right there. So I have it in a little bottle and I just pour a little bit in there depending on how much you want that pigment to show. That's how long you wanna let it soak in there. So I'm just putting a nice little layer of color right over those knuckles just to give it a wash of red. And then going in with the second layer just to give it a little bit of intensity of the same color. Then I take a clean bit of alcohol right there in the lid and I just run my finger over the edges just to kind of blend it out. Next I'm going in with my latex. I'm using balloon latex. You can either use this or liquid latex. The balloon latex is just a little bit thinner. So I poured it here on my table and I'm grabbing a Q-tip and I'm gonna go on to my knuckles just in a circular motion. Then I realized that I wanted to go back in with a clean Q-tip that's soaked with alcohol and clean up the knuckles so it has more of a bone-like color and you know it just gives it more of a realness. So after I finish cleaning up the knuckles and getting that scraped look that I'm looking for, I'm gonna go back in with my latex and start going right over the red parts of the knuckles. So for the first layer, I really feather it out and make sure that it's nice and thin. For the second layer, I definitely go in thicker just so I can get that lift when I'm trying to lift it up and make it look like ripped skin. So you really do wanna let this dry and be completely clear before you do anything. Um, you're gonna take a little translucent powder and here I'm just taking a Kryolan powder that I have and you're just gonna powder each knuckle so it takes away that shininess and the stickiness. So this is what some would say is the gross part or disturbing part. I'm going to grab my tweezers and just start peeling away at the inner part of the latex so it really looks like peeled up skin and I was just scraping it up against something or hitting it up against something and it just cut and split my knuckles apart. And I really love the effect that this gives, just the ripped skin effect over the knuckles. And this is something that you have to kind of layer color and then wash with alcohol, layer color, wash with alcohol. It is definitely a process. So here I'm just going in right on top of the latex just to give it a little bit of color. And then I'm taking the alcohol again and washing those knuckles so they still have that skinned effect. And taking a clean Q-tip soaked with alcohol, running it along the edges just to really blend out that red color so that there's no harsh lines. And that's about it with the paint job. So. That's the knuckles. Then we're gonna add the scab blood on there. Just taking a little tool I have, trying to get, you can use you know a really thin brush or something like that, and you're just gonna take it underneath the latex so that it looks like the blood is coming out from underneath the skin. Thank <laughs> you. 
And then lastly, I'm just taking a little bit of KY Jelly, squeezing this out and on a brush, putting it right in the middle so that it gives it a nice glossy effect. Alright guys, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you liked it. If you got to the end of the video, then comment down below the comment code word Fight Club so I know that you made it to the end. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!